Hi everybody, welcome back. I said I'll do a love uh, spell and I'm going to do that only right now. Let me just get the ingredients. I like doing spells which do not require many ingredients. So you need a red pen. You need white paper. Let me see if you can see it clearly. Yes, you need white paper, normal, not folded. This was, I was doing, uh, I was trying this uh, spell. You can, uh, uh, you need matchsticks okay and normal red candle you know if you have a tapered one or normal one it's fine but use a red candle or a pink candle okay so what i want to do is just light the candle please uh you know work with care you know when you're working with the candle and uh, you can light the candle before just be careful while working with candles guys or uh, working with such yeah so okay i'm gonna light the candle and just place it here I don't want it to fall so sorry guys just bear with me for a minute I'll just be back with you let me just secure the candle I don't want it to fall on me while I'm doing the spell so I've got the candle here I don't think you can see it here here see the candle so got the candle got the paper got the red pen so light the candle I've lit the candle like I'm showing you here's the candle behind the lamp okay I've lit it so you just light it like this okay and uh, put it any, on anything, you know, steel plate or holder. Do not burn your hands, please. Uh, work, uh, you know, be very careful when you're working with the uh, fire. And uh, so let's start the spell. Let's not uh, waste time. So think about the person. This is to, uh, you know, write a, a letter to your loved one who you're already seeing, you know, to strengthen your love or to attract a lover, you know, towards you. Or, uh, you know, if you like someone and you know, know that the person likes you back and you want more things to happen between you two or, you know, you want it to be serious between you two so just uh, remember this is for uh, this spell is for those people so write a letter nothing uh, i mean like i'm going to use john doe so just write whatever's in your heart hi uh, you can write hi, i'm going to write hi john doe i am really in love with you in love with you i want to spend all my time with you time with you and i want that you will always love me the same way you, can, you know this letter is personal so you can write whatever you want uh, that you will always love me this way you will always be committed to me please do not bind the person this is just asking the person what you want from the person committed to me uh, uh, you know, I, you know, we, you can write, we will respect each other, you know, because do not mind. I, I want it to be both have, you know, both value each other, respect each other. I want to be with you always or anything. I want to be with you. You want to say, call me. I want to talk to you or whatever, you know, uh, sending you love, more love, sending love your way. Uh, you know, we'll always be together. Sorry, my laptop is making a noise. Always be together. I'm going to sign Tam. Okay, so there's no John Doe, but I'm going to sign Tam. You can also put hearts in all the four corners. I want to put five hearts. Five is the number that I get by the Spirit Guide. So one, two, three, four, four corners. And fifth one you can put in the middle. So here's the fifth one in the middle. So you're going to write your own love letter. Please write whatever words you want to say. If you want to attract a new love, you can write, you know, uh, if you like someone, you can say, dear, this this and this, dear so and so, I want you to be with me. I want you to see my love, uh, you know. I want you to see the love in my eyes. I want you, to, uh, you know, to give me a chance so we should be together forever or whatever you want to write. It's attracting a new love, you know. Think about the person. So when you're thinking about the person, just fold it, okay, and put it in an envelope, okay. I do not have an envelope. You know, a lot of times I want, the ma I want to make the uh, spells easy. You know, if you do not have the envelope, like I do not have, so take the red candle, okay, and we always seal love with wax, no? So this is like, if you do not have, uh, if you have an envelope, put this letter in the envelope and seal the envelope with wax, okay? And if you do not have an envelope, just fold the letter and just put the wax. It's like you've actually stuck stuck both, both the pages, uh, sorry, both the folds together. That's all. Just uh, please be careful while working with fire, okay? I keep saying that again and again. Be very mindful that you're working with the fire and, you know, and it can, you know, just burn something around if anything is like a curtain or anything. Just just be careful, okay? So you can seal it. Yeah, I don't want it to fall on me. And when, when, it's, when it's a little hard, because I'm going to leave it here, 
then put a cross on this wax with a red pen okay or with anything you want but just put a cross okay cross it so uh, remember I'm going to say it again need a white paper you need to write your le letter whatever personal you want to say you know whatever the things you want to say to the person sign it off with your name put five hearts one in each corner and one in the middle above fold the paper you can fold the paper like this I mean one little fold that you can seal the paper like make it an envelope if you do not have the envelope when you're doing this please think about the person very lovingly and do not do it for a person who has no interest in you okay do not do it to test someone or don't do it otherwise you know if the other person is truly not interested in a long-term commitment uh, relationship or anything to be committed do not do it guys so this is going to uh, harden I'm just going to wait and once it ha is it's hardened just put a cross on it okay like just put on a cross on suppose this is the wax just put a cross on it okay that's a symbol you closed it with love keep it next to you okay like in a drawer in your wallet you can keep it or you can keep it in the mattress so people will ask me you know when will my lover be committed or you know when will I attract new love uh, whatever it all depends on your intentions and how the universe wants you to wants to work with you and how you working with the universe and um, and the right time you know and I always say once you've done it just let it go the person who really belongs in your life will be committed you'll see a change you'll see a difference or they, if there was someone you really wanted to attract a new lover if you were thinking about a person see how they are going to open up and come towards you so this is almost hardened with the same red pen just mark a cross on it okay here just mark a cross on it when it hardens a bit more I'm doing it because I just wanted to show you this is your love spell it's very easy and you see the person will actually uh, you know get more attracted to you probably will commit you know if they've not been uh, you know committing so a lot of things different things can happen and this is just my channel spell there are a lot of variations but this is what I thought I was getting in my mind you know that's what I was getting so this is your love spell very easy okay just keep it in your drawer or mattress and uh, you know whenever you want to dispose it off when you think it's working if you think after months it's not working you can you know tear this one throw it in the bin and redo it again okay there is no problem I mean there is uh, there are no hard and fast rules okay and the love letter can be whatever you want so remember you do not have to copy what I am writing so uh, after that uh, it's better to snuff the candle though I'm blowing it out okay I'm blowing out the candle it's always better to snuff the candle snuff just be careful or let it uh, burn totally or otherwise you know just snuff the candle here's the first spell with the okay red candle i'm going to upload another uh, spell with a red candle tomorrow i hope you enjoyed it it's very easy if you have any questions just put them down and i will answer like i always do bye guys all the best